Can you feel into your ancestral tongue? Your ancestral wisdom that's within you? That you are a descendant of right now? I know we can. Though sometimes we feel alone in this world. And yet we can touch into the vastness of wisdom and strength and bring it into this moment here and now. I invite you to touch your forehead. Maybe close your eyes. You are touching your skeletal structure. In Hawaiian, this is called the alo. Feel into your breath as you touch your alo. Ha is the breath of life. Alo, ha. And touch your heart. We are descendants of survivors of so much. Warring, oppression, untruth, lies. And yet we are here to bring our light because they did in the ways they could. On the shoulders of the wisdom of their ancients. Primal spirituality. That we get to be unique, wonderful expressions of today. I know what's possible. I'm on this journey and I know what I've come from and where I'm at. And I am so passionate about where I and we are going. And the journey can be grotesque, all that purging. And yet to stand in our light and to feel the breath of life, wind beneath our wings. I am that I am. Oh, I feel that too, right? Aloha. It's right here, right here. Right here, between us. There's so many times in my path that I felt alone. I felt that no one else is experiencing what I'm experiencing. No one else will understand. Anybody else? I think this is like part of teenagerhood, <laughs> for one thing. But adulthood, too. <laughs> in a different way. Different cycles of life, different maturations, levels of maturation. And I think the more and more we open ourselves to what's happening in the world, the more and more we feel, oh, I don't, I'm the only one that's feeling this. That's a lie. The truth is we are all feeling it. You ever feel, I spoke about this at Wednesday service, you ever feel you're in a room you're vibing, we're hanging out, and then someone or a couple or some people come in the room and the whole vibe changes. Mm -hmm. Like, it just changes the atmosphere. Maybe there's like hairs in the back of your neck go up like, whoa, what was that? And then you're looking at these some grouchy people just came in. Okay. You can just feel they're grouchy. They're in a the mood. <laughs> like, ooh, boy, okay. But what are we going to do about that? That happens in the micro the macro. We are feeling that too. And what about our alo? What about our ancestral wisdom and experience? And those to come.
We are the heart of the world and the heart of God. In that we can shine our light. Leaning into what is in this moment right here and right here.